Governor Henry McMaster spent the morning in Spartanburg signing a School of Innovation bill, opening the door to a new way of learning for students. And 7 News' Kimberly Brown has the story. Meeting Street Academy in Spartanburg's District 7 is an educational model that elected officials want to duplicate. <laughs> Governor Henry McMaster's signature makes it legal for school districts across the Palmetto State to open more than one School of Innovation. These schools work independently of traditional schools in their district. They are free to have longer academic years and the school starts for students at three years of age. A school of innovation is a school that has the freedom, a little bit of flexibility to do whatever is best for the child. That means removing the red tape in order to get students the help they need with issues at home and with academics. The curriculum at Meeting Street Academy is Eureka Math and Wit and Wisdom. Faculty and staff work with students and their families to identify challenges at home and, if necessary, partner with community agencies to help eliminate those challenges. House Bill 3589 takes restrictions off school districts. But uh, it was limited. We could only have one such innovative school per district and we have uh, 79 school districts. The effort to get the bill passed took a lot of conversations and negotiations among elected officials. Meeting Street Academy is in Representative Rosalind Henderson Myers' district. She and other lawmakers helped to get it passed. Because of the success of Meeting Street Academy here, um, legislatures throughout the country are looking more into public-private um, schools of innovation partnerships. There are 284 students at Meeting Street. The classrooms are small and students start school at the age of three. The school year is longer and the school days are too. There's no cost to attend. Medical care is provided on campus and there's an incentive program to help retain the best teachers. But now we'll be able to have multiple innovative schools and we believe that it will improve the student education aspects especially for black and brown kids. At this point, there is a waiting list for students to get into Meeting Street Academy. Reporting from Spartanburg, Kimberly Brown, 7 News. Right now, there are three public schools of innovation in this state, one in Spartanburg and two in Charleston.